but today the tip will be the point of form. The point of form, the easy way to you know what is the point of form is something like uh, the wrap in Maya. So, for example, I have this geometry, uh, and I have this other one. I have kind of a pose, so I can do a blend shape. Okay. So I have a animation blend shape. Okay? But what happened? We have this one for animation. This is like a low poly, but I have another one with my high resolution. And that time I don't have any rig, so they don't need any rig, so they don't have any animation. So the, the way you can use for deformation, I can have a blend shape, but I can have a point deform, okay? With this point deform, what happened? It's when I connect the point in form, now I have my huge resolution, okay? So the way it's working, they asking here, mess to the form, so it will be my render, and they ask for the point, uh, point res. Point res will be this one, and they ask for uh, point, for the uh, point the form and will be the t pose okay so now is the form and if you think about it i have another job is a complete different like a complete complete different is the armor but i need somehow to move this is what i have so i use the same point the form so i go again they say mess to the form so it will be this one, let's say rest point, more time with the rest point is better to use time sheet. The time sheet you use the code dollar sign F start. So they have they freeze. It's not any animation. You can see it's not any animation. But you can delete the frames. And the other one, point the form. So it will be this one. The, the huge geometry. So when they move this one, now my armor will be moving with this one. You see? It's the form. If I preview, I'll pre I will preview with this merge uh, here to here. And now I have everything deforming correctly. So this is all a simple tilt, but I think really utile, like a point of form. Okay.